Hey guys, today I'll be talking about Nissan Ragu, and I'll show you where the fuse is located in LBD port. So the first thing first is if you go inside, if you want to know where the OBD port located, it's right on the steering wheel and it's right in here. If you need to plug in the computer or for DQ to pass, that's where it's located. So the first fuse box will be right in here. To get it, maybe get a flathead screwdriver or I can just probably do it like that and just pull in it just carefully and that comes off. And this is the location where everything is located. Just like that. And then there's your fuses right there. And this is, I believe, the fuse puller. You can pull fuses with these. You just line it up, click it, and then pull it out. So that's, that's your first fuse box location. To put it back, you just line up these pins right in here line it up and and there you're good to go so to go, get to the second one you have to open the hood and it's located right here to open the hood if you need to open the fuel tank it's right here just pulling it like that There you go. So the second one located right underneath this filter. To take, if you want to take this filter off, there's a screw right here. So I was trying to use a screwdriver. Fill up mine didn't work, so I, I might use a 10 millimeter. So all you do is just loosen it. Once you do that, you might have clips here. I don't have it, but you might have to take the clips off right here. Once you loosen this, pull this up. And carefully, that comes up. Once you got that out of the way, now you get to your fuses. So second fuse box location right in here. You just take the pins right here, press on this one and that one. And that should go up. There's actually two more in the back. One here and the one on here. So a total of four once you got that. And then here you have the location of fuses. Which one's where? Just like that. And then if you want to pull this one up, you just go this way, and that one this way. And same thing on this side, here, here. And then that should pull up, just like that. Once you pull it up, and there's your fuses. So on the Nissan, and they're like inside. If you look under, that's where they're at, hiding. I don't know why they did it like that. Maybe it's easier to assemble, but that's how it is. If you need to get to, so you just kind of pull it up. So to put it back, you just line it up. Make sure one, two, three, four clicks. One, two, three, four. Before I install this cover, if you want to get to the third one, it's right in here. So to pull that one out, there's one here, one here, that comes up, and the one on the back. 
I believe, yeah. Actually, there's a fourth one right here. That pulls up. And the cover gets loose. And there's your location for the fuses. I think it's gonna be this way. Which one's which? And there's your fuses. Those are a few small ones, but mainly big ones right here. And some really. Just to put it back, just line it up, make sure four of them click. Just like that. This is good. Then you can put this one back. Make sure you line it up. It goes this way. And this one's ready to go, just like this. And don't forget to put your air intake, or whatever this cover is called for the air. Make sure you line up right here, right there, and that should be good to go. Once you're lined up, grab your screw, tighten it. Thank you for watching. Please consider subscribing if you haven't subscribed yet. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.